Hey YouTube, welcome back to my channel. If you're first time visiting my channel, welcome to my channel. My name is Toyo, and I'm here to do a reading for y'all. So hit that like and subscribe button. Thank y'all so much for the likes and subscribes thus far. And let's get into this video here, okay? So I already pulled one card, and this is y'all's energy, okay? And y'all energy is very sexy here, okay? There are people that are watching you. I feel like these are your old lovers, your ex-lovers, your ex-friends, your old sneaky links, whoever you used to deal with romantically or sexually. These old people are watching you because some of y'all, y'all recently posted a new photo or maybe they recently seen you out looking real fine, real good, but it's a lot of emphasis on you guys being real fine, real sexy here. Y'all might even be in a sexual-like energy. So, like I said, if it does not resonate, I'll see you later. Love y'all. Um, everybody can, Everything can't resonate with everybody, but right now, the energy that is coming out is very sexy-like energy, very sexual energy, and then your exes or people that you used to deal with watching you. I'm telling y'all, some of y'all recently uploaded a photo or something, um... Or maybe you uploaded a post. Or maybe, like I said, they send you out. But the energy behind you is very sexy here, okay? I also kept hearing this song. Boy, I really want to stay and play that little game we play. You go hide and I will seek. Let me be the one to make you weak. Like, I don't know if it's y'all energy or one of these people that is watching you. But either, this is you, and that song is like a duet. It's like a boy and a girl singing, I do believe. So maybe this is like how you're feeling towards somebody. But somebody like wants uh, to be the one to basically make you weak. They want to be the one to get up in them draw. If this is how you're feeling, okay? So some of y'all, you're single, and this is what's going on. Like, you're looking good. Somebody's like, damn, you see the collective. They posted this or they went outside and they was fine to fuck or whatever's going on. Like, ooh, we, she oozing sexy. He's oozing sexy. Whatever's going on. But I feel like you're attracted to this person too. What's this person's uh, energy? Oh, Lord. But then we got the nympho. So maybe this person's... person be very experienced sexually okay and like i said it's almost like here you are like yeah i don't know you are too or you're turned on or they're turned on by you but i do feel like this person over here comes with drama like i feel like they're very experienced they're really good in bed but it's like they come with drama i wouldn't have sex with this person i feel like they're depressed and they will Push their energy off into you. I know that sounds like weird and real nasty, but that ain't what I meant. But some of y'all are teasing this person. I'm telling you, I'm telling you. I don't know what y'all are doing, but somebody, it says they get off knowing that you're watching, craving them. Some of y'all know somebody's watching you. Some of y'all are fine as fuck. Some of y'all got body. Some of y'all, y'all just got some new clothes. Some of y'all, is this your man or your woman? But it's like you're teasing this person. You know what you're doing. You're like, yeah. Some of y'all, somebody might have an OnlyFans. I really don't know. But some of y'all, like I said, this is boiled down to you posting photos. But I feel like y'all know that y'all are sexy. But the thing is, you're, you got good boundaries though. Like, you, it's like you're teasing somebody. You're so sexy. You know that you are sexy. You might have posted like a, a thirst trap. You might be looking real good. Or like I said, you just look good. But it's like you know that you're sexy. You're like, mm, I feel like this dude really like me. Or I feel like he want to get back with me. Because I do feel like it's somebody from your past. I just feel like y'all kind of teasing this person a little bit. Okay? Um, but you do have good boundaries. It's like you're teasing somebody, but you have good boundaries. It's like, damn, I really want him. Like, let me be the one to make you weak. But at the same time, I got my boundaries up. Or two, you're posting photos or you're out looking good. <laughs> And then they want to be the one to make you weak, but you're like, oh, I don't know. I don't know. But I see somebody wanting to come in to break the ice with you. Okay? But this person might have just got a divorce or maybe they're hiding the fact that they're getting a divorce or, yeah, that they were married or I don't know. But, yeah, I see y'all being attracted to somebody, but still having your guard up, still having your boundaries up. But them being like, they might be a little older than you because I put that they're very experienced. So either one, they just 
I hear I get around. <laughs> Either they get around for real, so they know how to fuck, or they're a little bit older than you, so they do have more experience than you. Okay, cut father star. But here you are. Okay, the thing is, your sexual energy is out of this world. The thing about this person is, because why? This, yeah, it comes with drama. The thing about this person is, I feel like they might be good in bed too, but it would not be worth it because they got somebody that is connected to them that is jealous. Okay? Um. So either one, they already in a relationship. They already got their own thing going on. You're already in a relationship. You already got your own thing going on. Um, or two, this person is very wanted. Like, remember I said their experience or they might get around? The thing is, if you fuck with this person, it's almost connecting you to the people that are jealous of you. Like, these other men or these other women that they done had sex with, okay, that are jealous of you. It's almost like, damn, they're giving them some type of access. So, this might be why your boundaries are up. Some of y'all, y'all made a bad judgment call. Like, some of y'all, y'all seen the people that they fuck with in the past. And you're like, fuck no. Like, Really? That's who you fuck with or that's who you used to fuck with? Like, some of y'all, y'all judge them. <laughs> yeah, the devil. Some of y'all, y'all judge them. <clears throat> some of y'all, y'all making a judgment call on them. Because, like I said, uh, it does feel like they have gotten around or they get around. Or you maybe know somebody that they hooked up with before or that they been with. Or that they gave head to or that gave them head. Maybe this person try to get want to give you head or... I don't know, but it's just like a lot of emphasis on you being so sexy to this person, but you also being attracted to them as well. Them wanting you, but you having your boundaries up because you don't want drama. I don't want no drama. You don't want no drama. No, no drama. No, 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 no drama. So don't pull on my ass, boy. You ain't my man, boy. I'm just trying to dance, boy, and move my humps. My humps, is you, are you dancing somewhere, but you really is teasing somebody? Don't pull on my hands, boy. You ain't, you already got a man or they already with somebody? I'm just trying to dance, boy, and move my humps. My humps, my humps, my humps, my humps. My humps, my humps, my humps. My lovely lady lumps. My love, they got you. So, yeah, somebody's like looking at your body. You have an out of this world body to this person. And I feel like you know they watching you. So y'all y'all posted like, ooh. You might have went to school with this person or two. This person has been studying the fuck out of your body. Like I said, I think the only thing holding you and this person back is the drama that will come between it. Or come in, in between it. Because either you got somebody or they already got somebody. If, if both of y'all are single, the issue is they have gotten around a lot. They got a lot of people that claim them. Almost like, like, it's like a, that's mine. She's mine. He's mine. This is probably why you don't trust it. It says as bad as she wants to, she just does not trust it. Some of y'all, y'all know some of the people they don't fuck with. Like, you don't, it doesn't mean that these people are your friends or your family member. They just mean people that you know, like, <laughs> you just know of her. You don't have to, like, you know, oh, this person, no loyalty. But maybe, like I said, you don't want the drama that comes with that. Okay, so as bad as y'all want to, I just still see y'all having y'all boundaries up. But I still see y'all being like a tease. I still see this person being in awe with you. I still see this person or it's more than one person though. It's multiple energies. It's because you guys are so very beautiful. A lot of y'all y'all are a lot of people's crush. It says everyone's crush. Y'all don't realize how many people have a crush on y'all. Although you're very, some of y'all y'all might post thirst traps and it's not to like try to get anybody. I feel like y'all post what you post or maybe you're very just beautiful. It doesn't have to be thirst traps. Uh, but I see y'all posting, like, photos that look good or you guys maybe looking good. Maybe it's just out. I don't know what it is, but still having your boundaries up. But still being so fucking, like, you just, ooh, sexy as hell. If you're not sexually attracted to these people, no matter what, like, when these people see you, you're oozing sexy. Some of y'all, you're really attracted to this person because they're really laid back and cool to talk to and easy to talk to that's why you want to connect with this part that's why but at the same time your boundaries are up like i don't know but i promise y'all some of y'all are fantasizing of like some of y'all want this person and i feel like they equally want you too 
this person has been fantasizing about you. Some of y'all, y'all be, I'm telling you, y'all think, y'all think about this person too. If you are not mutually sexually attracted to this person, this is not your reading, okay? This is somebody that you're like, damn, I kind of want him, but no, because he used to fuck with this girl and that's his type, or he used to fuck with him and or she used to fuck with her, her or she used to fuck with him, like. It's, it's like you kind of having your boundaries up because you know of these people. At the same time, you know you don't owe these people loyalty. Okay? Or two, like I said, you already got something going on. <clears throat> but I see this person, like, fantasizing about y'all heavily because they feel like you are so sexy and you are so beautiful. Okay? This person fantasizes about sneaking, being sneaky with you. So this person, like, wants to fulfill a fantasy. They daydream about, like, literally... Like being with you sexually, some of y'all this might be you, but it's more so like on a, on a snip on a sn Some of y'all it's another girl, so this is what some of y'all the sneaky energy is like. This is a this is another girl, but you attracted to her too, kinda. Okay, it's not for everybody. If you know you don't like girls, you don't like girls. If you know you're not secretly attracted to a girl, you're not secret. Then that's not for you. But for somebody. There's a lesbian, and they're very experienced. Maybe you're not so experienced with the same sex if you're a feminine. Because I'm, I'm only seeing the feminine here right now. Um, but it could be masculine. But maybe you're not experienced as experienced with the same sex. But maybe you got your boundaries up. But it's like an energy of you, like, teasing this person. I see you wanting this person. I see you being sexually attracted to them. Whether it's another feminine or not. Uh, Cause a lot of y'all, it's a it's a laid back guy, but for some of y'all, like I said, it is a lesbian. But I see you being mutually attracted to them as well, but being like nah, because whoever you know, maybe a nah because I need to get to know them more. Maybe you want to get to know them more, nah, because of whoever they date, whoever they used to date, nah, because of whoever they came with. Some of y'all y'all attracted to this person. This person is equally attracted to you, but. You came with a group of people or you came with some friends. Maybe they came with some friends. So it's giving me like y'all seeing this person out. Or like I said. On social media. I'm telling y'all. This person's connected to somebody you almost dropped. Like somebody's crazy connected to this person. Or crazy connected to you. And that's why you don't want to have sex with this person. It's because you know that this person is going to know. It says they know you gave your body to someone else. <laughs> So, you know this person's going to know that you fuck with this other person or that they fuck with you, whatever's going on. There is somebody that's crazy as hell that is in the middle of, what I say, a sexual connection. This is really a sexual connection. So, this is why I see y'all saying goodbye or y'all being like, nah, I can't do it unless they not with them or they don't fuck with them. But I see this person want to come in with pure intentions because they want to get to know you better. Like, they don't want to just fuck, but they do want to fuck. <laughs> I see this person coming in with pure intentions, genuine intentions, real good positive energy. Like, this is probably why you want them. They're definitely a vibe, and y'all are very sexually attracted to each other. On top of that, y'all have a very spiritual connection. So, yeah, it's almost like you've seen somebody or you meeting somebody or you already knew this person. The, the vibes between you two are very strong because y'all have a spiritual connection, and y'all have a very, very intense sexual connection. Um... Even if y'all haven't had sex, the, the sexual vibes between you and this person are undeniable, okay? Like I said, the issue is, because I feel like this person is single, but the issue, or if they're not, like I said, the issue is whoever this psycho energy is. This person that claims this person or this person that claims you, even though you or this person may be single, it's just the energy I feel like you don't want no problem with. Okay, come find a psycho. Yeah, because this person gets real insecure whenever they don't feel good enough for you or good enough for this person. Like somebody goes off their rocker because they start to feel insecure, especially because you and this other person have sexual connection and y'all actually are talking or y'all actually will have good conversation. Somebody feels insecure about that and it makes them want to like snap or some shit. Okay. I also feel like maybe some, this, somebody else is feeling insecure because either you or this person that you're connecting to, y'all got money. So it's almost like if somebody wanted you and they're like, man, 
fuck her. She don't want me because I ain't got no money. Uh, I see them feeling insecure and, like, going a little crazy. Vice versa, like, maybe uh, you got money. I don't know. But I just see somebody feeling insecure. But you and this person, like, you're just oozing sexy as fuck. But you're innocent. I, I, see, like, I feel like you still ain't do nothing to this person. But your energy is just beautiful. Sexy and sweet. You have a real beautiful soul. And then, like I said, this person that you're attracted to, they're also very abundant. And like I said, the, I really feel like it's a karmic. I don't know. if I, Maybe this person isn't a karmic, okay? The thing about this person is they go back and forth between being divine and a karmic. Meaning, they might be in karmic energy right now, but they're not actually a karmic. They're actually going to be a divine masculine or divine feminine, maybe in the future. But maybe right now, they are just in karmic energy. Okay, yeah, they're not on the right vibration. They're not on the same vibration as a divine feminine or divine masculine. So they might come off as karmic, whoever this person is that you don't want drama with or you don't want to fuck with this person because of this person, whether they're tied to you or this person. They are going to come off like a karmic because they're either young or they're going to come off as a karmic because they still got lessons to learn. But in all actuality, I see this person actually being a divine masculine or divine feminine as well they just have to mature maturity is within the mind okay so yeah i see y'all not like i said i see the connection between you and this person is very strong um maybe there's gonna be some things that happen between you and this person in the future but for right now i just see sexual energy between you and this person okay um and you wanting to, but like I said, you not really wanting the drama. Like, I'm good. Like, he go with this girl I used to go to school with back then. and Or he used to date her, and she's crazy as fuck over him. Like, that type of energy. That's why I see, like, y'all are kind of, y'all kind of got your guard up a little bit. Like, no, I don't know if I'm just finna. But I'm telling y'all, something is about, the future card came out twice. There is going to be something that happens between you and this person in the future. What's going on? Especially if... Oh, no. Some of y'all going back to the... Like, you're attracted to a girl, your girl, or vice versa. You're attracted to a dude, your dude. I don't know, but I see the vibes here. I see the teasing. I see the sexual energy. I see you wanting them. I see them wanting you. If this is not you being, you know, LGBTQIA, like I said, this is you. It says, love who you want, fuck with who you want. Uh, be proud of who you are. This is not you literally getting with this girl that you feeling like you kind of got sexual energy with or this guy. Like, you're not gay. Okay, 100%. This is just you deciding, like, you know what? I've been wanting to fuck you. I've been wanting to fuck with you, and I'm going to. Okay? So, this is you in the future being with who you want. <laughs> doing what you want. Doing what you've been wanting to do. Because, like I said, it's almost like you really don't owe this crazy person nothing. You're innocent, but you're very abundant, okay? So, yeah, that's pretty much what I got for y'all. My kids are starting to come downstairs. Hope it resonates. Love y'all. Bye. Go and take a little trip. It's such a future with me. Go and take a little dip. Go and take a little time. Get that energy right. We gon' get it together. There's the car, the cars, the key clarity, the cars, the cars, the key what you need. Subscribe to my channel.